Now let's see how to change the properties of parts using code. For example, let's say we wanted to change the transparency of the base plate to something other than zero. Now to do this in code, we need to instruct the program where to find the part we want to change. In this case, the base plate is inside the workspace, and workspace itself is inside a hidden object called game. Now to help the program find the part, we start at the top level, the hidden object I just mentioned called game. Then we use a period, dot, and then we say the next thing to look inside of. In this case, we want to look inside of the workspace. Now that we're in the workspace, we can say to look at the base plate by typing dot base plate, and making sure that we spell it the same way as you see over here in the explorer. Now that we're at the base plate, we can say that we want to change a property of it. We have to use another dot, and then the name of the property we want to change. In this case, we want to change transparency, so we type that out. To store a value into transparency, we do it the same way we store a value into a variable. We use the equal sign, then the value we want to put in. So let's say 0 0.5. We hit enter, and now the base plate is translucent.